lots of times, especially in the first couple of years, where I felt really self-conscious in public, especially with the pressure garments on, because most people don't know what they are. They've probably never seen someone who's been burned, and it's new and it's natural to be curious. There was a few times I remember when I was probably 12, 13, you know, going through that kind of identity crisis, what am I going to look like, that kind of thing, um, where I had a couple of splints on to put the picture properly. Like it's not like just a splint that goes to your arm, you're kind of just like, you know, chilling down here. It's like a splint that goes away. So you're walking around like this, just sort of waving your arm around. And I didn't like um, people looking at me. Like I thought it was really weird. Um, I didn't appreciate it very much. The person from the news, he sort of had covered the story of me and everyone in Laveley all knew about me. So they're all just like, oh my God, you're okay. And I'm like, thank you, great, who are you? Generally, little children ask you, so I always tell them and tell them that playing with fire is not a good thing and to stay away from it. And they'll ask how it happened and, you know, they always ask, does it hurt if I poke you? They don't want to hurt you, they don't judge you or anything, they just want to find out about it. <laughs> My dad just came and grabbed me and said, what are you worried about? They're looking at you because, you know, you're different. Like, it's nothing else, it's just that you've it's just like, hey, what's, what's going on over here? It's just like if there was a guy walking shirtless through the shopping centre, people would look at him. People would do it to anybody, it wasn't just sort of singling me out and it kind of helped ground me a little bit because I wasn't the centre of the universe. Well, when I'm out in public, I do look around a lot to see people looking at me because I think they're going to be looking at my scars. All the sympathy used to bother me because I just wanted to get back into my normal everyday life. I don't mind now when People are like, oh, I'm so sorry, because, you know, they're reacting as you should. <laughs> I've never really been bothered by the scars. I kind of feel like I own that. I'm happy to walk around, uh, you know, wet and wild or whatever with no shirt on. I was burnt on the chest. And um, to me, it's almost like a symbol of victory. Burns Camp has given me so much more confidence in myself. It's an organisation where all children that have been burnt and have scars go along and you build up your confidence. It built my confidence up a lot. It makes you feel so much better to know there's other people out there that have scars and have been through the same sort of stuff as you. Skin deep at the end of the day, like it's, it's skin deep. People don't even really realise sometimes because I'm just so out there and just doing my own thing. They don't even really sometimes pick up that I am um, burnt.